What's up everybody, Sensei here. Welcome to the show. Welcome to another video. <laughs> this is definitely going to be something a little bit different today. And I'm going to show you why. Normally, I would be on roller skates. I grew up roller skating. I can actually roller skate pretty, pretty good. And that's something that I'm going to bring to the channel. I just need to find a good skating rink around my area, indoor rink at least. I do know one, but it seems to have a whole lot of little kids there. Not that I don't mind skating around kids. It's just it can get a little hectic. So I'm trying to find another one. So I picked up a pair of rollerblades. Now I do like rollerblading, but I prefer roller skating. I mean, I probably learned how to roller skate before I could walk. I can roller skate better than I can ride an electric unicycle. I can get down on some skates. So I think that's what I wanna to bring to the channel is just trying to find the proper place to do it. I think I might've found an outdoor place but my skates are all set up for indoor and I really don't want to have to take my wheels off and all that type of crap. So I might just get a pair of outdoor skates and I fit these things up and you know, get to, get to uh, laying down some skate moves. But I can rollerblade. It is fun, great exercise. And I'm just trying to expand the channel a little bit. So, I will give you the stats and all the trimmings about the skates that I have on my feet. It's going to appear right about now. By no means are these top of the line skates, but for the money, they were 65% off. They roll great. They feel fantastic. And I think for skating around outside, they are perfect. But they're going to get banged up. Overall, I'm happy with the purchase. And I would recommend these skates, even though this is first impression, I would recommend these skates for people to buy them. You won't be disappointed. It has been so long since I've been on a pair of rollerblades. I'm talking, wow, maybe nine years, I'm thinking. I'm thinking about nine years, maybe 10, I don't know. But it's been a very, very long time. And I used to actually skate through the streets of New York City on my K2 rollerblades. Me and my, uh, my cousin Jay, so Jay, <laughs> If you're watching this video, bro, those are some good days, man. I'm not going to make this video any longer than it has to be, but there's definitely going to be some rollerblading and roller skating coming to the channel. I, I don't know. Let me just see how I can set up some outdoor roller skates. Whew, I don't know. We'll see what happens. Because I, I think the channel, I love EUC content, I do. But I think it would be awesome to have some roller skating content. I can actually teach people how to roller skate because I can get down. I can get down on some skates. Again, much better 
roller skater than rollerblader, but I can do both. And I can ice skate as well. You know, growing up, if you didn't roller skate, you didn't go anywhere. You know, roller skating was cheap. I used to roller skate probably four nights a week. It would be Friday nights, excuse me, Thursday nights, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday nights. And then it got to a point like in the 90s, a lot of the roller skating rinks just start shutting down. And then when I moved to New York, they had an outdoor rink down at Chelsea Piers. And my cousin Jay and I, we would go down there Saturday nights, sometimes Friday nights, and we would skate. We had a blast. And then where I'm currently living now, I would go to the Woodbridge skating rink but it seems like they do so many birthday parties out there i don't know if they have an adult night anymore it just it gets kind of crazy um when you're skating you have a bunch of people I always say etiquette man you got to have some skater etiquette and you got people going in so many different directions so if they do get another adult night out at woodbridge i'll start going back there but until then i will see where else i can go Anybody in the comments section below, if you know a great skating rink uh, in New Jersey, please leave that in the comments. Yes, and I can skate backwards too. Woo, man, it feels good, though, to be out here. I think I need to put on uh, another pair of socks. But the skates do feel pretty good. I'm surprised they roll very well. Again, this is a first impressions video. This is my first time stepping on these skates, these inline skates. And they are made by Story. They feel really good. And uh, that's really about it. So let's see what we can do in the upcoming weeks. With some new content i will still be doing euc content as well but we're going to see if we can expand this channel it's growing very well it's growing rapidly for me anyway and i appreciate everyone that comes to the channel stops by even if you watch it for you know the video for 10 seconds i appreciate each and every one of y'all seriously the love i've been getting is fantastic and i just want to keep the content coming and just expand a little bit so thank you so much for the 1520 subs uh, wow and um, again appreciate each and every one of you remember you get on your skates and you skate them like you hate them whether they're inline or roller skates quad skates you get on them things and you roll them like you hate them I'm sensei hello good night and enjoy the rest of the video So what I can do just to fix some of the play, they feel really comfortable, which is good, because sometimes it's hit or miss when you're buying inline skates or roller skates. They feel great, but there's a little extra play in it, so I might just, one, I could take and wear an extra pair of socks, two, a thicker pair of socks, or just put a new insole, or just add another insole in it, and I think that would be prime. And these things will be over the top, but they feel really smooth.
I'm having fun. <laughs> what? This is so awesome. Dude, I'm telling you. Let me get my face in the camera. I'm telling you, I can't wait. Sorry about the lighting here. It's close to 8 o'clock up here in Jersey. But, man, I'm having such a great time. I can't wait to get on some roller skates. Now, I don't know how it's going to be me trying to film in a roller skating rink. So, that's going to be a challenge. We'll figure something out because this has to be some new content coming to my channel, man. I'm looking so forward to roller skating and putting it on the channel. I don't know what else to say. I got this big cheesy grin on my face like a kid because, man, you guys have no idea the amount of hours that I spent on roller skates. Even though these are roller blades, you guys are going to be in for a treat. I'm telling you, you're going to be in for a treat. I'm going to bring the Pittsburgh flavor of roller skating to New Jersey. And I will do some inline, but I think I might order the outdoor skates tonight. I think I saw a pretty good pair, pretty good pair, a pretty good pair for a solid price. Okay, that is it for real. Thank you all for joining me. Enjoy the rest of your weekend. This is Sensei on some story inline skates. Thank you all for joining me. Hello. Good night. Don't fly too high